chi, an adjective, an adjective that means an adjective. Hi. Mean the truth. You speak yes. truthfully, or this is the truth it, case. It's just like correct. It's not really like truth. If you want to express truth, you'd probably use a different word like gg2 or something like that. It just means correct. Tadashi. And you'll see the kanji right here a lot when they're counting to five in Japanese. Um, What's correct in Japanese? Tadashi. Hi, hi, hi. Shi. Um, so we have an e adjective. What is the negative form of e adjectives like this one? Negative form of e adjectives. Tadashiku nai. Perfect. Yep. Tadashiku nai. Can you read this word for me? This here is tatsume. I feel like we've seen this before. Do you remember what this means? May it's to explain something so, or to so. clarify? To explain, to clarify. So it ended with may. Do you know what it started with? Start with setsu. Hi. Setsu may. Um, could you read this example sentence for me? Norobo wa machutsushi no setsu may o ita. Uh, this is the thief. Um, can you listen or does he ask a question? Theoretically, mm. it could be either, but I would assume we're using the Mimi here because this doesn't really sound like a question, does it? Sensei no setsume? Sensei no setsume, meaning he, um, he listened to the explanation of the magicians. Hi. That just like makes more like logical sense. Um, a lot of times you'll see like a ni when you're going to be asking someone a question. So like doroba wa sensei ni kita. I mean the thief asked the teacher because there's like a, a directional thing going on. So if you don't see a ni, it's in the sentence. It's probably going to be listening, but it's definitely like you have to pay attention, uh, to what it is. Um, this word starts with setsu. Do you know what it ended with? Uh, tatsume, tatsume, Hi, tatsume. can you read this sentence for me? Um, it is, uh, uh, well, um, ona ko shaku no tatsume wa tadashiku nai. Perfect. She is the explanation of the Duchess is not Correct. Perfect. That is definitely a possible translation of this. I was going to translate this as the Duchess explanation, like the one that she gave, but the opposite is possible. It could be describing the um, Setsume as an explanation of the Duchess. Both should be possible, which is interesting. Um, and just letting so you know, you don't need to do this. You'll probably naturally start doing it. But the E with the she right here, it's not that aggressive. So a lot of times you'll hear tadashikunai rather than tadashikunai. It just makes it more obvious. We don't have an E adjective, like the E hiragana character is still there. So a lot of times you hear that kind of slurring going on with these kind of things. Very common with Hi. she. Um, can you read this for me? Dai tai. Hi. So this is an adverb. Do you know what dai tai means? Kind of similar to mean, ichiyo. Yo. Does it mean in general in a yes. in a uh, in a grand scale sort of a yes. way? Yes, more or less. Generally, oh. dai dai, perfect. And let's go read the line from the book. So this is what Khan is thinking. Uh, neburi no tetsume wa dai dai. So what it means here is the explanation of Neburi or Neburi's explanation. What do you think makes more sense context-wise? And here it's say Dai Tai Tarashita. 
in general is true. Right. The explanation from nobody. That makes more sense in this context, yes. Because Neverly is talking about all the people of Wurumetto, right? He's like, you know, it's kind of dangerous right now. Um, I don't know if you could help me, boy. And same with this one, we a lot of times you'll hear tadashikatta, or I'm saying tadashikatta. The e is like basically gone. Tadashikatta. Become silent. Um, can you read this word for me? Aruji. Hi. So Aruji is like master or owner of something. Aruji. Um. Do you know what kagiru meant? Kagiranai. Okay. Kagiru. To close something, to lock something. That's a good guess. Good guess. Sadly, it's not that word. Um. Let's read the sentence. Higure no kimi to atta mono wa. The Lord of Twilight. I thought after meeting the per after meeting with the Lord of Twilight. Or meeting with the the the, the wa. So Speaking the of mono. meet the meeting with the mm, hmm? speaking of meeting what is speaking mono of meeting mean? with the Lord of Mono is the person. Hi, the person that met with the Lord of Twilight. Um the the person um that met with the Lord of Twilight. Mujini without any problem. Modoteru towa and and um modore to return um kagiraren kagira nai kara you know what this de uh, is adding to here rather than just being modoru we say modo deru what is de doing in here it is the passive form of the verb close it's not passive it's potential passive if you remember is a Deru, which does have a de in it, but there's no a sound over here, so it can't be passive, so it must be potential. So this is can return safely. To kagiranai. To kagiranai. To kagiranai. Right. To wa kagiranai. That is kagiranai, meaning it's not possible, right? Close. It's not limited to. Kagiru is to limit. So this is Kagiru. because it is not limited to being able to return safely, the person that meets with the Lord of Twilight. So this insinuates someone that meets in the Lord of Twilight could be killed or murdered or something like that. So this is not the limit. The limit is not returning safely. The limit is being sent off in the sea with some chains and a, and a weight attached to you. Um, okay, so what does kagiru mean? Kagiru is the limit of something. Hai. So it's, it's not limited to. Hai, if it's negative, um, correct. Do you know what this kanji is read as? Is read as um, ash, ash, ashir, ajiru. Close. Ajiru. It does start with a and does end with do, but it's actually going to have a do in the middle. Middle aruji. Aruji. Hi. Can you read the sentence for me? Oops. Um. It is. Here it is. Um. Machi no aruchi wa. With regards to the lord of this town, the uh, Higure no Kimida. The lord of this town is the lord of twilight. Perfect. The, the head of the, the ruler, master of, of the town. So, so. Can you read this word for me? 
見る限り。So, 限り、えー、as we saw earlier, was to limit, right? It's the limit of something. Sorry, not the limit. So, 見る限り、うん、it means as far as I can see. This does not have to be physically seeing. This can also mean the same thing as far as I know. As far as I know. Okay. So it can mean both. As far as I can see and far as I can know. Miru kagiri. Miru kagiri. Miru so the limit kagiri. is what I can see. As far as I can see. As far as I know. As far as I can see. As far as I know. Hi. Um, now you get to go read the line from the book. And here it says, Ore, ore no miru kagiri. As far as I know, Kono machi no aruchi wa the master of the town, Ona koushaku no fresuta, Fu foretsu haru. Perfect. The Duchess, the, uh, is, is this her name or is this yes. her, her place? It's her name. You wouldn't say Duchess oh. and then Wurometo. Could I be describing Wurometo as a Duchess? Kind of weird. Like, I guess you could kind of do that. But just, you would normally do the opposite. You would drive the Duchess as... Wurometo's duchess, right? Versus the Wilmet that has a duchess. It's a little bit odder, right? Um, yeah. Foresutaru is the namai of the onna koshaku. So what does this say all together? All together, as far as I know, um, the master of the town is Foresutaru. Um, the Duchess. Hey. The Duchess Pure Sutaru. Perfect. Do you want to read this kanji? Setsume. Perfect. How about this one from last time we met? This is uh, kanke. kanke. Perfect. How about um this verb? Uh, it is um. Anashi Hachimeta to Perfect. begin speaking. And this one? Jitsuri Yokusha. Perfect. And our last of influence. one. Yes. Influential people. Tarashi. Hi, Tarashi. Tarashi. Tarashi Kata. Hi. Could you read this word for me? It is. um. This here is Akeba. Akebo no te. Sadly, Akebo this is no. pronounced as gai. So, tasogare gai, that we've heard of before, is over here in wurumetto. Akebo no gai is over there. Akebo no is Ak don. Don. So, what does akebo no gai mean? The street of don, or the don mm. district. Hi, perfect. The Don District. Hi. Can you read the sentence for me? Mm -mm. Uh, it is. Um. Onash koshaku wa, as for the Duchess, akebo no gai ni. At the district of Don, uh, su sumu. So sumu, so sunda, sunda She reside. She reside at the at the um the Don district. Perfect. Now, if you ever forget, it, you are allowed to have names like that. Say Akebo no Akebo no district, because you will see that a lot of times in translations, names won't be translated. So that is like fully if how you want to do that. You can translate it as Don, or you could just say the name. You know what Erabu means. Erabu, erabu is to choose or to, to elect. Erabu. Right. And now you're going to be forced to remember how to read it. What is the ta form of to choose in Japanese? 
the top form would be um so this is the boo boo okay. boo boo mu so it's gonna be um mm, mm, mm. boo boo mu mm, mm. uh naranda naran naranda naranda is the top form close naranda is to line things up from narabu so this does not have a na in it but it does have a da in there though what do you think Era. about? Hi, er. Eranda. Eranda. Perfect. Can you read this word for me? This here is e can e in e in. E in. Hi. This is a council member. Someone that was elected onto council. E in. Can you read this sentence member. for me? E in. Hi. Oh, it should be. Uh, it is. E in or e, uh, e in? Mm, oh, it's Gim. I'm sorry. Gim, Gim. Uh, I think <laughs> Gim is a committee is... member. Uh, maybe. But yeah, this is Gim. It's so similar. Member of the Diet or member of a parliament. So, 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 so. Member of Congress. <laughs> so, the Gim O. Eran, Eranda, the Duchess elect the committee, um, the member of the assembly or Perfect. the ruling member. Do you know what Kadiru means? I think it's to return or to borrow. It is to borrow. Borrow. To return right. is Kashite. Kasu. Kashite. Yeah, and when you say like "kashite when you turn it, I don't know. Um. Anyway, Are you return for me. Kashite <laughs> kiranai no. Um. Want you return it? Uh. Anyway, let's go. Uh. Read the sentence. Ah, jibun no eranda giin wa kashite. Kashite. Kashite is return. Kasu is another way to say Lin. Kasu. These are different Kasu lending words. Uh, sorry about that. So yeah, Kaisu is to return. Kaisu. Kaisu. Kaisu to return. All right. So here it's a jibun no eranda in wa. Yakuni tata nainda. So here the word jibun is modifying eranda, meaning um, it's modifying eranda gin, the member that was elected by me. No, by himself. By themselves. By themselves. So this could be me or it could be they. It's whoever is talking, basically, or whoever we're talking about. The self-selected or self-appointed member of parliament, they are useless. Right? Mm. The self-selected representative are... It, it, I, I don't think Yakuni this could be nai. modifying gain. Uh, this, this don't worry about the jibun. to say iranda gain for now. It'll make more sense when you see the example sentence. Hey. So yeah, the, I mean, this is... the chosen council is useless. But Moni, was, hey. is that doesn't make sense because of grammatical reason or for a I feel like it reason? doesn't make sense for a grammatical reason. I'd have to read how Jibun works linguistically to tell you why. I, I think it has to do with this being like its own box-like thing with how Jibun refer to things just jibun no eranda gain meaning the gain eranda themselves it sounds really weird but i am not natives i mean they could they could elect themselves i mean they could <laughs> it they sounds could work wrong. Match, you know it doesn't <laughs> sound right I, I think that might it could it's a possible the issue is eranda 
Because you don't choose yourself. You could say, oh, I want to join, but you wouldn't use Iranda there. You, you'd say you, you would volunteer, right? So that, that'd be like another, mm. like that's the possibility that the issue is with the choosing verb. Right. <laughs> it's a different possibility. But Aranda does. But Jibun like a... does have some interesting uh, laws for how it's used, though. It's like, so it could be either. I don't know. I just know if I read that, I would never think <laughs> The gain elected themselves. Hi. Uh do you know how to read this kanji? Um and I saw a word that say you can divide yourself. You, right. can, you can do an act onto yourself. Sadly, I, this never is... mind. Uh Kariru. Ka, ka, kariru tomorrow. Hi, tomorrow. Oh, I think I get the difference. So kariru. It's a borrow. Kase is to lend, and kaise is to return. Uh, <laughs> those are those three words. So I borrow, they lend, and I return. Right? How do you do? Kaise I was like sitting in my head. Return. Um. Okay. Do you know how to read that kanji right there? Oh, you're missing a fourth one, Mani. Kaer is I go I go home. <laughs> I, speaking of kaeru, not only does it mean I go home, there's also kaeru with the same kanji of kaisu to mean an object returns on its own. Like the object, uh, like for example, a voice might return on its own. So the object returns somewhere. So it's another. also kairu? Hi, they're pronounced the same. Different kanji. Oh, you know what messed up? And then there's also there's modoru. another kanji called kairu. You mean frog? <laughs> and then it's modoru, which is to I human return. Modosu means I, um, means I return an object to a location. So this is kaisu, means I return to a human. Modosu means I return to something, an item to a location. Hi. You're just making things well, more so and more complicated. Well, actually five, six, seven, eight, seven. So many. Yeah, they're they're. Mm -hmm. These are all returning ones. There's one, two, three, four, five returning verbs. Luckily, only one land and then one bar. <laughs> but returning is when it gets complicated in Japanese. Hi, hi. It's when it's returning that when it's split up in meanings. Okay. Hi. hi. Uh, anyway, uh, did you say what that was read as? Um, tasuke. Hi, tasuke. Tasuke to, to help. save, to help. Perfect. Tasuke. So when you see tasuke on its help, it's like the noun help. Like, yeah. Uh, yeah, let's go read this example sentence. Dorobo wa majutsushi no tasuke o. And this is to borrow kai. or kaesu ka ka right? kai this kari uh kaesu kai i'm like confusing you is to return return home or no to return an object hi to someone else so so like to return a library book kaesu karita i return the help Mm, at the no, no, got confused again. What is return? I, 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 I borrow. I borrow. So, so, so. I borrow. I borrow I... the help of the magician. Uh, I... The thief borrow the help from the magician. Perfect. Um, can you read this word for me? Akatsuki. Hi. Akatsuki also then... means dawn. Goten. Do you have any no. guesses what goten might mean? Go. Go is an honorific. Yeah. Ten is. Ten is uh, a point. So goten means palace. Oh, we saw the kanji before. Did we? From the I'm palace, sure. from the mansions. Uh, is it in Teitaka? What's the word for mansions again? Mansions is a mm. pen, something pen, 
Doesn't look like it's. Oh, wait. Nope. It's not in the words we learned. No, Yashiki not. and Teitaku okay. does not have that kanji. I know. I thought if it's going to be 10, like Gasaragi Te, something like that, but it's not. So Goten has all new kanji. It just it just was mattered if you like heard that a lot in anime or something, right? Goten kind of sounds like a house. Yeah, this is a palace right. or a castle. And Okatsuki is the same Okatsuki that shows up in Naruto. The, they're called, that's why they the have dawn. their red clouds. The dawn. the dawn. Hi. This is the Dawn Palace. So this right here is the Japanese map of Wurameto, where we have the yes, uh, Yugure Yasuki and the Katsuki Goten on opposite sides of the Kawa. This is a um, little oh, map for you. Yeah, the west over here and the east over there. Anyway, mm. let's go read this line from the book. Hi. Um, onako shaku wa akebo no akebo no gai the district of light or the district of the dawn, the dawn district. Ni aru the duchess is at the light, the uh, dawn district. Akatsuki Goten ni Sunde iru. She reside in the palace, in the uh, Dawn Palace. Okay. Oh, so I'm I'm getting it now. So it seems like there's a there's a geographic division between the Lord of Twilight and the Duchess. Basically, yeah. Uh, jurisdiction. Do you know why this is ending in Adu? Uh, Adu is for inanimate thing. That is correct, but that wasn't really my question. As you translated it as if there was a period here. Which is the Duchess, who does not have feelings, lives, I mean, is in um the Dawn district. You think that was what they were trying to say here? No, yet. yeah, <laughs> because she does have feelings. She is so, the so. living person. Not only Therefore, that, there's Aru not a period modifying. here. I do, no matter what, has to be modifying a noun, right? Because it's a relative clause. I... It is, is a relative clause. <laughs> <laughs> it just happened to end right at the end of the page. <laughs> so yeah. tricking my brain. <laughs> Um, Don't worry, I'm Aru, showing modify. you only one sentence at a time. Keep an eye on the periods. Okay. Super important. Akatsuki. Akatsuki. Hi, hi, hi. So, the Duchess, um, the Duchess that's at the Dawn District. Sunderu. Uh, uh, okay, one more time. The Duchess reside at the Dawn Palace. That is in the um the Don district, the Don right. Palace in the Don district. Perfect. So Aru here, the thing that doing the Aru here is the Goten. So so so. Perfect. And the one doing Sunderu is the Onna Koshaku, one living. Hey, right. that's why Perfect. she took the Iru, and so, it so. take the Aru. To some extent, hi hi hi. Um. Uh, let me come. How many more do you have? Ah, uh, sorry, we're running out of time. Um, you know. What, so osameru is to govern. To govern. Can you read the sentence for me? Ona kōsaku wa machi o osameru. The Duchess governed the town. Perfect. He governs the town. Do you have any idea what higashigawa means? Higashigawa, the eastern. The eastern side. Perfect. Nice. Can you read the sentence for me? It said loading. <laughs> okay. Kawa no Nishigawa no Asogare Gai no Ukai wa Kawa no Higashigawa no Akemo no Gai da. Perfect. So mm -hmm. the 
the um, that which is opposite to the twilight district on the eastern bank of the river is the um, is the Don district, which is on the eastern bank of the river. Perfect. Nice. And whew, I think we're going to make it. Let's get to go read the line from the book. Ona koshaku wa jibun ga eranda gi in no taske o karite. Um, the Duchess uh, borrow the help of the assembly member that was chosen that was elected by herself, by herself. She elected them. Um, and, and Machio Osame, uh, she received that help and she governed the city. Kawa no Higashigawa no Akebo no Gai ni aru. Akatsuki den go den ni mu uh, to reside is mu it's it's mu right it's uh it's sumu so sunde sunde iru. Uh, she governs that city, and she resides at the Don Palace that is located in the Don District. Um. That is on the eastern bank of the river. Perfect. Nice. Good job. So that is where we're going to end for the day. Phew. That was where it was gonna right. it was gonna <laughs> stop on us, but it didn't. Yay.